especially in these last days that um, the Lord is calling us back um, to humble ourselves and repent of our sins, I think he's going to continue to increase um, the signs. It's even in the Bible um, that in the end times, the signs will increase. So I just ask that you pray and ask the Holy Spirit to lead you and remain open. Um, the Bible says for those that have eyes to see, will see. And for those that have ears to hear, will hear. So just remain open and non-judgmental. Um, and ask the Holy Spirit to lead you. So after I had left adoration, I received this word, and I just want to read it to you. Um, the scripture that the Holy Spirit uh, led me to was Colossians 1.6, and this is the NIV version. I know a couple people have asked me that. Um, that has come to you in the same way. The gospel is bearing fruit and growing throughout the whole world just as it has been doing among you since the day you heard it and truly understood God's grace. Um, so that is beautiful. And then the Holy Spirit was speaking to me. Um, he said, restore your people, be an Esther to the world. I, your father, need a voice, someone to be consistently bold for their faith. A paradigmal shift is at hand. Woe to the wicked who cast their pearls to swine. Woe to the lost who seek worldly, earthly treasures instead of eternal sanctification and salvation in me. The storehouses of heaven are waiting for those who will humble themselves before my glory. Enter into praises and thanksgiving, always honoring your Father before all things. Nothing shall come before me. Come to me, humbled and reverent, repenting of all sins. I shall make you white as snow. No one can remove the stains except I, your king. I am the king of kings and the Lord of lords. There is no other above me. The time to repent is now, bowing down and humbling yourselves before me, worshiping no other deity. I am all-powerful. I am all-knowing. I am God. My capacity to love is beyond what you can imagine. Quit boxing me into the parameters of your thoughts and ways. I am capable of all things at all times. I am of restorative power. I can make all things new. I bestow upon all gifts and beauty. The world is full of self-proclaimers and self-doers. Get out of self. Remove self from all things. This is when I am given the capacity to move and work. Give me the glory. I am what each of you need to get beyond this present state. Keep your eyes stayed on me, not on this world and its empty treasures, filling your bellies but for a day. Seek me in all things. Seek me for all things, always. And also, after this word, he gave me Hebrews 2.4. God also testifying with them, both by signs and wonders, and by various miracles, and by gifts of the Holy Spirit, according to his own will. Also, you can look up Mark sixteen twenty, and they went out and preached everywhere the Lord working with them and confirming the word through the accompany of signs. Signs and wonders, miracles are not for the Christians who already believe. They accompanied the gospel and were done in the presence of the unbelievers to have them believe in the message. So I just wanted to share that word with you today. And also, the, um, the Holy Spirit in the past few days, like I said, has been leading me to um, the Bible to confirm um, through His Word, which is always a great confirmation, confirmation in testing the spirits, is through Scripture. So, um, you know, when I receive these words from the Holy Spirit, I always, uh, my spirit is piqued because of um, the Scripture to back it up. So... In this, I just read the, um, the Holy Spirit's words. 
Uh, the first part of Woe to the Wicked is Isaiah 3.11. And who cast their pearls to swine is Matthew 7.6. Enter into praise and thanksgiving, Malachi 3.10. Also, Psalm 104, 100, 100 <laughs> verse 4, sorry. Um, and then a deity is a creator, a supreme being, which God is our creator. And then um, he makes all things new, which is Revelations 21, 5. And then seek me in all things, seek me for all things always, Matthew six thirty three. I hope this blesses you. Um, Please check out um, my next videos where I am going to show you the other experiences I had and a picture from the other uh, gold dust experience I had. God bless you all.